The respondent while reacting to the development said most worrisome is that the mad people are allowed to move unrestricted. They said other issues that should get the attention of the state government is the public menace by street urchin who asks for arms. The respondents called on the Commissioner for Women Affairs and Social Development to do the needful and get rid of mad people from the city as a way of complementing the ongoing clean-up exercise by Governor Godwin Obaseki's administration. I particularly think it is alarming if we can get traders and artisans off the street, then to allow people that are in some cases social miscreants to be on the street begging. You understand? It's uh, alarming. If there is provision for social welfare, they can be kept in a particular place where their needs could be met. The government is supposed to know that um, they have to take these people to the place they ought to have taken them to, like psychiatric. Because leaving mad people in the street with normal people, no, this can happen. Are you getting it? Just imagine baby, a woman who is just carrying a baby. A madman may just go eat the baby or one or two can just happen. So it's not that too good for normal people to live with mad people in the streets. There are mad people all over the world. It's not only in Nigeria and Benin City in particular. But how do you control this menace? It's by way of government getting themselves involved. There are curable ones. There are ones that you can get cured with 20,000 naira. They'll be well. We have a particular ministry that is in charge of this, right? They are supposed to come out and do their job. Not just sit in the office. You're supposed to move. That is why you are employed. You're supposed to move. Get these people off the streets. Give them somewhere where you can cater for them. You understand? We have a uh, psychiatric. It's not everybody that can, that can feel the bees. Government should come into these areas and assist. Get these people off the streets. After several attempts to get the comment of the Edo State Commissioner for Women Affairs and Social Development on the issues failed, sources close to her office said she will speak on the development on a later date. I, Boji Ihoria, reporting.